Out there in the huge duskiness of space, the James Webb Space Telescope has been exploring the dim for replies about the universe. It's NASA's new eye above and has been finding stunning pictures of stars, immense structures, and planets. In any case, eventually, something unforeseen has been tracked down. Something so enormous it could shake the very spines of all that we realize. It has researchers scratching their heads and inspecting whether it could prompt the uttermost constraint of everything. Join us as we investigate how the latest exposure of the James Webb Space Telescope could annihilate the universe. At the point when we investigate the edge of the universe, it is the noticeable early phase. The recognizable universe looks like a window through which we can examine the tremendousness beyond the recognizable universe. It envelopes everything that we can at present recognize, measure, and explore using our telescopes and space tests. It's an assortment of stars, universes, and heavenly bodies within our degree of understanding. In any case, the perceptible universe is essentially a little piece of the whole universe. Imagine it as a bit cut of an enormous vast pie that we're ready to study and fathom. While the total size and condition of the universe at large remain a secret, researchers measure the width of our unmistakable air pocket to be around 93 billion light years. A light year measures the distance that light, the speediest thing in the universe, goes in one year, around 588 trillion miles or 946 trillion kilometers. So, when we talk about the broadness of the perceptible universe being 93 billion light years, we're talking about a tremendous stretch. Around 13.8 billion years ago, the universe burst into reality in an unimaginably solid impact. This impact began what we call the Big Bang. Since that huge birth, the universe hasn't just been growing. It's been advancing rapidly in its extension. Puzzling powers like the jumbling dark energy seem to be driving the speed increment, pushing the limits of the universe farther and farther apart. As the universe extended, matter started to blend under the impact of gravity. This gravitational force joined particles, birthing shocking plans, stars, vast frameworks, and eventually planets like our own dear Earth. Picture the universe passing by as these huge plans shaped, progressing into the different and still maturing quarks we see scattered across the universe today. Regardless of its colossal size, the universe is amazingly empty. Assuming that we were to contract down our whole planetary group to the size of a quarter, the closest star would in any case be about the length of two soccer handles away. This limitlessness grows just inside our own Milky Way galaxy, which is only one among billions in the observable universe, giving us a sense of the sheer size of endless space. Now, you might inquire as to why we can't simply see all that exists in the universe. There are a couple of clarifications behind this limit. Most critically, light, the fastest thing known to man, still sets aside some time to travel through space. This suggests that when we take a gander at distant objects, we're essentially examining the past. The farther an object is, the more its light has traveled to contact us. It's like looking through an unlimited time machine unrolling the history of our universe. As we notice galaxies millions or even billions of light years away, the genuine universe is extending. Imagine spots on the outer layer of a blowing up balloon. As the balloon becomes larger, the spots move farther apart. This same standard applies to the universe. Galaxies, like those spots, are floating apart as the fabric of space expands. This expansion causes the light transmitted from distant objects to go through a shift known as redshift. Essentially, the frequencies of light stretch as the objects push away, moving toward longer frequencies, frequently seen as a rosy tone. Given these factors, light's travel time, the expansion of space, and the universe's continuous advancement, it's not amazing that we haven't yet totally noticed the entirety of the universe. For sure, even with our exceptionally advanced telescopes and technologies, our view remains limited by these key properties of the universe. The journey to understand the possible edge or limits of the universe has enthralled the minds of countless individuals across disciplines. While decisive answers remain elusive, three recognizable hypotheses have emerged, each presenting interesting perspectives on the perpetuation of inestimable space. The first hypothesis suggests that the universe extends immensely, going on endlessly without a noticeable edge. This idea lines up with the cosmological principle, 
asserting the isotropy of the universe, its consistency in appearance from any vantage point. If this principle holds, it proposes that the universe misses the mark on limit, broadening perpetually in all directions. The subsequent hypothesis offers an alternative view, proposing that while the universe may for sure be limited, it comes up short on a clear edge. Rather, it is like a huge circle or a bended space akin to the Earth. In this situation, if one were to travel perpetually in any direction, they would eventually return to their starting point like circumnavigating the Earth. The third hypothesis, the multiverse theory, presents a captivating thought that our universe is just one. Among countless others, imagine multitudinous parallel universes, each existing with its own set of physical regulations, constants, and properties. These universes may be totally separate from each other, working independently, or they may be interconnected through complex systems, forming an immense and multifaceted multiverse. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, remains as a signal of potential, enlightening the secrets that shroud the huge origins of the universe. This great instrument has an unmatched ability to unwind the confusing past of our universe, allowing us to peer far beyond what was previously possible. The JWST is a mechanical miracle designed expressly to notice the universe with exceptional accuracy. Its advanced capabilities stretch our vision to the earliest moments of the universe. As of late, a groundbreaking study published in the famous journal Nature revealed the JWST's discovery of six massive galaxies, dating back between 500 million and 700 million years after the Big Bang. Incredibly, these ancient galaxies are far larger than expected for their early presence, challenging the prevailing theories of universe evolution. Furthermore, their development in the early universe is truly surprising. What's remarkable about these discoveries is the level of progression of these ancient systems, opposing the assumption that galaxies formed slowly over time. These heavenly giants display a degree of complexity similar to our 13-billion-year-old Milky Way galaxy. The sheer number of stars inside these colossal behemoths surpasses observation, with each boasting a total mass several times greater than our Sun. Strikingly, one of these galaxies may even have a mass up to 100 billion times that of our Sun, eclipsing the already massive size of our Milky Way. The JWST's unmatched ability to see the universe's secret spaces relies on its usage of infrared light, an invisible range to the naked eye. This remarkable power enables the telescope to capture the weak emissions from ancient stars and galaxies, revealing massive remnants that have persisted for billions of years. Essentially, the JWST acts as a time machine, moving our vision back through the ages and offering a fascinating look into the universe as it appeared roughly 13.5 billion years ago. The continuous discovery of massive galaxies, warmly nicknamed universe breakers, has disrupted our understanding. It's much like rewriting history, a stunning twist that challenges many of the models we had established for early galaxies. Initially, we thought galaxies formed from humble beginnings, starting as small collections of stars and dust. They were believed to gradually grow, increasing in size and complexity over time. However, the universe breakers have shattered these ideas. When the JWST's data and its high-resolution images revealed these titanic structures, these enormous behemoths appeared seemingly out of nowhere, as though they had just been waiting to be discovered, puzzling our previous understanding of galactic development. Digging deeper, Scientists used spectroscopic techniques to examine light across different frequencies. This assessment holds the key to unlocking crucial insights about these mysterious worlds, such as their structure, size, and distance from Earth. It's like a vast investigative story, with light as the key to revealing the secrets of these colossal entities. The surprising discoveries from the James Webb Space Telescope have transformed our understanding of the universe to remarkable levels. This cutting-edge telescope, operated by a global team of space scientists, has recently unveiled a shocking discovery, the identification of the oldest and most distant galaxies ever observed. These galaxies transport us back to when the universe was just a tiny fraction of its current age, existing only a brief time after the Big Bang. The James Webb Space Telescope, out in the massive darkness of space, has been searching for answers about the universe. It's NASA's latest vast instrument, capturing stunning pictures of stars, galaxies, 
and planets. Recently, it made a discovery so remarkable that it could change how we understand the very fabric of the universe, leaving scientists perplexed and curious about its potential implications. When we study the universe, we begin with the observable universe, a window into the infinity beyond. This observable universe includes everything we can currently connect with our telescopes and space probes, including stars, galaxies, and other divine bodies. However, it's just a tiny part of the entire universe. Experts estimate the breadth of our observable universe to be around 93 billion light years. A light year measures the distance light travels in one year, around 588 trillion miles, making the reach practically boundless. Around 13.8 billion years ago, the universe began with the Big Bang, an epic explosion that triggered the Great Expansion. Since then, the universe has been developing and accelerating, driven by mysterious forces like dark energy. Matter began to coalesce under gravity, forming stars, galaxies, and eventually planets like Earth. This continuous development shapes the universe's epic size, allowing us to observe just a small part of its endless complexity. Even with the expansion, though, much of the universe remains dark and empty. Despite how far we've come in exploring space, most of it remains out of sight. Despite the incredible progress we've made in space exploration, there are still vast stretches of the universe that remain unseen and out of reach. While modern telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, have significantly expanded our view into the distant cosmos, there is a limit to how far we can peer. This limitation is due to several factors, with the most prominent being the speed of light. Light, which is the key to observing celestial objects, takes time to travel across vast distances. When we look at faraway galaxies or stars, we are actually looking at light that has been traveling for millions or even billions of years. This means we are not seeing the present state of these objects, but rather their past states. The farther an object is, the older the light we're seeing. It's like trying to watch an event on the other side of the world, but with a time delay. And with the universe constantly expanding, the light from more distant regions is stretched, resulting in a redshift. This redshift shifts the light towards longer wavelengths, making it harder for us to detect. The combination of the immense distances, the expansion of the universe, and the limitations of current technology means there will always be parts of the universe that are beyond our grasp. We can only study the observable universe, which is a fraction of the entire cosmos. Even with advanced tools like the JWST, our understanding remains limited by the horizon of what we can see and measure. Yet, the JWST continues to push these boundaries. Its ability to detect infrared light allows it to see through cosmic dust and observe objects that are farther and dimmer than ever before. It's offering unprecedented insights into the universe's early history, the formation of galaxies, and even the birth of stars. But, even with such breakthroughs, the mysteries of the universe are far from being fully unlocked. The discoveries made by the JWST could also challenge and reshape many of our existing theories about cosmology, such as the rate of the universe's expansion, the nature of dark energy, and the very existence of galaxies in the early universe. Moreover, the possibility that the universe is far more complex and vast than we can currently imagine suggests that future discoveries will likely alter our fundamental understanding of the cosmos. Concepts like dark matter and dark energy still elude us, and theories about the shape and fate of the universe continue to evolve. The universe may be expanding in ways we do not yet comprehend, and some scientists even speculate that the observable universe might be part of an even larger multiverse, an endless collection of parallel universes that exist beyond our own. In essence, while the JWST and other space missions continue to unveil the secrets of the universe, they are also raising new questions. The more we discover, the more we realize how little we know about the infinite expanse of space. The universe, with all its beauty and mystery, seems to hold many secrets, and each new discovery only deepens the intrigue. As technology improves and our understanding grows, we may one day be able to answer some of these profound questions, unlocking even more mysteries of the universe's origins and its eventual fate.